Okay. Oh, no, no, shouldn't we turn it there? Welcome to my bike. No, we should turn it. Landscape. I forgot. Bees. There's bees. Bumblebee interlude. I don't see any. It's down there. Bee. That's a little baby bee. Oh my god, your camera's so good. Hey, look, there's a, there's a bee. There it is. Right there. A bumblebee. Or back there. Up there, up there, up there. Way back there. Okay. Come here, bee. Raspberries. It's about our bees. That's weird. Okay. I guess it'll work. I think the camera's... I need to get the phone up. No, no, don't. No, no. Oh. Hello, and welcome to our new trailer. We just bought a 1986... We just bought... <laughs> Sparking. Okay. Hello. We just bought a 1986 Comet Satel. <laughs> Although the previous the, the seller told us it was a Satel was the model, but I think he just meant short for satellite as a genre of um, camping trailer. So it is not a tent trailer. It is a camping trailer. It's about nine and a half feet long from kind of point from front to rump and it's six and a half feet wide i forgot to see how high it is but it, it's it's probably six feet uh at least more than six feet no no in interior um oh interior yeah we uh we rolled it up uh jessica and i just with our brute strength uh by grabbing it and just rolling it into place and uh it's as easy as that so it listed at about 450 kilograms so, how many metric tons is that? I don't know. Uh, this is the back of it, the back end. We've got it inflated. Uh, there's a new spare tire with it. Um, and I have to replace a light bulb and put the, the hook up. thing back on and our what hook up? The water and electrical are over there. Oh, yeah, yeah, the water and electrical are over there, but they're too close to the, our neighbor's car. so. We don't have to go right there, but there basically there's a hookup for electric, for uh, like an extension cord for just your AC, your 110, 120. And there's a hose hookup, a hose adapter. You just plug a garden hose from your water source. Uh, so we'll we'll run it like that for the first part of the summer. There's also pro propane tanks, so we can run our propane stove in the inside, which Jessica, Jessica will, will demonstrate. And there's uh, also a fridge. So this is a little filter air filter thing is on the back of the fridge to provide a little bit of air supply but the fridge is a typical rv uh, ac dc or gas operated so that's great that's kind of the outside i mean there's a there's a lot of reflectors um maybe we'll uh we really like this kind of teal blue yeah and it continues inside you'll see it inside uh here come on come on Come on. Come on, kids, we're late. Come on in. Come on, we're late. Um, <laughs> see the windows, there's more windows here. Yeah, and here's the door. We've got a little step. Um, and the door clasps open. Look over here. And then there's a screen door. It just pulls out. And, uh, and we'll go in, and then I'm gonna turn into Jessica. Whoosh. Shoop. Perfect, there we go. Oh, hi. Come on in. Welcome to our trailer. It's our little roulette. As you can see, the teal carries through here. This is oh. our kitchen. Hi, it's me again. It's Chris. There's a mirror in the bathroom door. Get out of my shop. This is not a toilet, but it could be in the future. And this is our living room. Um, I'll give a more detailed tour, but just so you can get a full shot. Oh, we should have set up the pillows. Hang on. Wow. Wow. As you can see, it's oh. been freshly renovated. Oh, my God damn it. As you can see, the... God damn it! As you can see, the previous owners renovated it. This paneling... Where can you see it best? This wood paneling that you see all through is just a laminate. But it looks nice enough. And we like this teal that goes throughout. It's one of my favorite colors, and I like how it goes through the to the outside um, and they redid the floor too which I think is just also a laminate yes yeah um, so the only big thing to really redo in my opinion is the I'm gonna make new cushion covers um, for these big cushions although 
we kind of like this design because there's a little bit of teal in it that picks up the teal throughout. Feels very retro. Yes. Authentically retro. Oh yeah, retro. This is like a picnic table cover, but we That's... realize that underneath there's a nicer wooden table. So mm -hmm. we wanted to give a total before shot with this. Um, so up here we have storage. This is a little padded thing. So this is where um, you can allegedly um, put your children when they're being bad. Let me show you. No. no Obviously no. you could just shove them in here. Just, yeah. Get in! Edit that down. I regret my decisions! Oh yeah, watch the light. Yeah, you gotta kind of push this down. There we go. I know, yeah. Okay. Ta-da! So it's a little bunk. Free little, sleeping. Little bunky. Um, it is like a generous single. Action. <gasps> There's little stars. Cute, cute. There's some markers, whatever you want. This is, um, apparently we can't put an adult up here. It's not strong enough. You can't go, you can go too far. You've gone too far. Oh yeah, are we gonna do a, a bed thing? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Are we gonna do like a TikTok bed thing? You don't wanna, I don't think we wanna, do we wanna demonstrate this? Ready? Bed! It's but, actually pretty roomy. Yeah. We both lay down at once and neither of us can, uh, like, we can sleep comfortably right across. So we'll be spooning, but that's all right. No, we don't like to touch one another when we sleep. I actually prefer to sleep alone. Mm hmm. So that's why I thought Chris could sleep, but apparently not. I can go up there. I right here, there. we have the radio. Oh, yeah. And cassette player. I know my dad will be very excited about that. One speaker per there. We haven't actually tried any of that stuff yet. I think a smoke and carbon monoxide detector, fire, fire, fire extinguisher. Get to it. Um, and so for all of these windows, my plans are to create actual built-in um, blackout, not curtains, but like just little things, little boards that you can press right into the window itself, which I've seen. So that's one of my big goals before we leave. So we can get it nice and dark in here. Chris is going to, as you can see, the table doesn't quite go all the way. So he's going to build something to support us on this lip, because obviously when you sit at the edge, you just go straight down. How about, uh, what's in the, what's in the toilet, not toilet? Would you give me a sec? I'm not done. So this is a little skylight we have here with a screen and it's sort of, it's covered this way and then there's a vent there. I don't know how much airflow we actually get through that. One kind of thing I would like, but it's not an immediate need, is to have a, an electric fan up here so when you're sleeping it actually draws mm -hmm. the air in through the windows and hot air out. out through the top. We will definitely do that. Yeah. We won't be going full AC I don't expect with how small this place is. Also you just sold your air conditioner. You can't put a house size air conditioner in here. Sure you can. Okay. It's gonna be a fan. It's gonna go up there. Think. Easy enough to do. Easy fix, easy solution. Oh, and well, I guess there you saw. We have both a regular door and a screen door. Screen door, yeah. So I'm quite happy that all of the windows and doors have screens. That way we can have everything open without it being buggy. Um, so here, this um, edging, I don't know what you call it. <laughs> edging? Beep. Um, so the edge here is um, really crumbling and especially around here you can basically just see the counter and it just came off. Plywood. Yeah. So we gotta fix this in some way. I can fix it. Yeah. Mr. Fix it. The point of this video is to basically um, document what we're starting with and then we can show everyone what we've done. Yay! In a month when we leave. Two months. A month and a half. Okay then. Bye. Bye. We have storage. We have lots of storage. All down here. Little drawers and things. You can see a little bit of the original tile down there, which I kind of wish we still had, but. No, it's not tile, it's like a. Laminate? Laminate, linoleum maybe. You can see the fridge. This is the fridge. It definitely needs a clean, but it even has a little freezer. That's pretty cool. We can make ice. More storage down here. What's this? And this is our little power center. Um, so you can plug in 
like a fuse there. You can plug in a plug there. This is where you change your fuses and this is on a Mm -hmm. <laughs> right? Yeah, that switch goes from uh, your, uh, that's your converter and it supposedly changes your power from DC via the battery to AC. Yeah, but, that's what I said. Yeah, okay, good. Now, what's in the other? Now, our toilet. I like that it has a mirror on here because that makes it more spacious, but it has a cute little click lock to open it up. Ta-da! It's a little closet. Mm -hmm. It used to be where there would be a toilet because we had toilet paper. And I think we would, no we'll make it a toilet again. With just dirt or mold or something down there. Oh, I mean, let's, you know, not think of it. It's almost not worth talking about. Almost not worth talking about. Almost not worth thinking about. The water hose goes through there. Oh, look. Allum feu. We can start fires. <laughs> more storage. Yep, so more storage right now. They've just been... What are we doing? Screws. Um, right now they've just been using it as storage. And closet. And changing room. Changing room? Yeah, it was part of the reason I think they uh, elected to not go with a toilet was that uh, the previous owner's daughter was 12 or 13 or something. Privacy. She needed privacy. Okay. This was her private place. What are you doing? Oh my god, am I stuck? Oh, there's a lock. Oh my god, Chris. Oh, are you stuck? Wait, let me see if I... Okay, that was scary. <laughs> There's a lock on this side. Okay. And then that undoes it. Interesting. That was okay. Time. So I think we'd like to, if not this summer, uh, we'd like to turn that into a toilet eventually, maybe with a composting toilet. That'll be a bigger renovation. And lastly, the kitchen. So up here, just more storage, which is kind of shallow because there's the front of um, at the front of the trailer. Um, then we have our gas stove, so it needs a good clean. But here we go. I haven't really looked at it yet, but should be working. Should work. And I like that this comes down, so you get more counter space when you're not using it, which seems to be a pretty standard thing. Mm -hmm. um, it'd be nice if we could build something to go over top of this, likewise. Yep. Because that's a good way to get more counter space. Um, but yeah, this is the original tap, just an on and off, and they left it in even though they put in a new tap and sink. So this is what actually works, and I would like us to have some kind of like a gray water system going on here, like you could just pump in lake water, but then have this be drinkable water to fill up a glass. I think that would be a cool system, but... Mm, yeah, we, we can do something like that. A plug. Mm-hmm and just more storage so the um sink just drains straight out underneath but this is where we'll put a reservoir or something mm -hmm. so that we don't have to just be connected to a hose we can have something to take with us and same over here oh yeah it's hawaiian themed if you couldn't tell from the pillows which are in great shape but just not our style so we'll be getting rid of these elements i'm gonna go for cottage grandma core if any of my family are watching this it's what our original cottage looked like looked like that our great grandpa built which really matches like the old 70s couch that's really the inspo <laughs> so i think i'll be doing some more of the aesthetic work in here and chris will be doing stuff like installing solar panels yeah, um, we'll put those on the roof put solar panels on the roof because we have no battery in here It'd be nice to be able to be a little bit off grid by having a water reservoir and having a battery. Anything okay. Else? No, I think that's good. We should do a goodbye. Okay, together? Yeah. Uh, how do we do that? Okay, goodbye. We live here now. We're leaving. <sighs> Come on, kids. We're late. Come on, kids. We're late. <laughs> Stop resisting. Nom, 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 nom. Nom, 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 nom. What do you want? Let me open this door. Look. Oh. 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 Oh, you're out. Yeah, there you are. Now you're in. Whoa. Oh, now you're in again. Rouletteception. It's Inception? Rouletteception. Rouletteception. <laughs>